Hello friends, my name is Ramasu. Today we shall discuss about a topic the models, methods and artifacts from Pimbog Guide 7. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting especially if you have interest in project management or you want to learn about it. So let's just start friend. So first of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. Uh, basically friend, we have taken this topic from uh, Pimbog Guide 7. Uh, in simple terms, models, methods and artifacts are the tools to get the job done. PMI describes them as options for enabling outcome. Model, a model is a thinking strategy to explain a process, framework or phenomena. Method, method is the means of achieving an outcome, output, result or project. Artifact. Artifact can be a template, document, output or project deliverable. So in a sense, models and methods are inputs that help us do the work of managing a project and artifacts along with deliverables are the outputs. However, unlike deliverables which the client or users want, artifacts are the interim deliverables that we need to create along the way. According to the PMI Project Management Institute, a model is a way of thinking to explain a process, framework or phenomena. A method is the means for achieving an outcome, output, result or project deliverable and an artifact is a template, document, output or project deliverable. Friend, uh, as we uh, uh, f know from pro tailoring process, a project managed by a manager is completely limitless to tailor the process and use whatever model, method or artifact according to the needs of the project. However, there are options to make the selection process easier by providing a brief introduction of models, methods and artifacts. A met method, model or artifact used in a project should provide value that is worth the effort, should be useful should serve the needs of the project team instead of individual. A new section in the guide uh, list, uh, project management guide, common models, methods and artifacts available to project practitioners. This new section provides a brief description and maps each model, method and artifact to one or more of the project performance domains where it might be most applicable or useful. A model describes a thinking strategy to explain a process, framework or phenomena. A method is the means for achieving an outcome, result or project deliverable. Artifact is a template, document, output or project deliverable. Sample models include process group, ADKAR, situational leadership, uh, Sinefin framework, Tuckman ladder, theory of needs. Sample methods include probability and impact matrix, lesson learned, project closeout, story point estimation, net promoter score, wide band tel5. Sample artifacts include project charter, risk register, stakeholder engagement plan, prioritization matrix, user story, value stream map. A model in project management is a way of looking at the world. It's the simplest version of how things work used to give you a general overview and a direction to follow for your own work. The Pimbok Guide 7th edition talks about models as a way of helping project managers understand what is already out there that they can use in their own work. Think of models as shortcuts approaches that present a way of thinking that are tried and tested and is 99% likely to be applicable to your organization. They give you a framework for how to respond to a situation or deal with a prop project scenario. Some models mentioned in the PMBOK Guide 7 are specific to project management others are more generally relevant to the world of work. 
The models mentioned are not supposed to represent an exhaustive list of every model in the world that might be relevant to your project, nor are they framed as recommendations. Instead, like so much in project management, they are part of your toolbox and you are supposed to be able to pick and choose what is going to be the most useful depending on the specifics of your situation. The PIMBOK guide talks about methods, models and artifacts. PM models sit alongside methods and artifacts as part of the framework for managing a project. During your project, you will have to select the right artifacts to create the right methods to use and the most appropriate models to shape your actions. Getting the combination right is probably easier than you think, especially if you have had a bit of project management experience already. Categories of model There are a selection of commonly used models that feature as part of the life of a project manager. The project management models most likely to come up in your project management professionals studies and in your work as a project manager are situational leadership, communication, motivation, change management, complexity, conflict, project team development, negotiation, planning, process groups, stakeholder salience. Some of these are per, uh, proprietary models like ADKAR and situational leadership, which uh, I learned as a graduate, uh, like for example, we all learn from it. So like process group, so did you spot the project management process groups in the list? If you were wondering how they fitted into the seventh edition, then they are how to use the project management models. Some models have several ways that you can use them. For example, models of project complexity might be useful at portfolio, program, and project level, as well as for explaining to individual sponsors why you need extra resources or budget to deal with complexity factors. Some categories of model might have several options inside them. For example, there are several models for team deployment, but the one you and your team decide on using is the ever popular Tuckman. Uh, he of forming, storming, norming, performing, and adjourning. Some models are going to be most appropriate for different project performance domains. For example, you would use conflict models like Thomas man in the team performance model actually now we can talk about uh, discuss uh, we shall discuss about later so I hope friends you like this video if you like it please share it with the friends and colleagues and thanks a lot for watching the video thank you friends